So, Harry, Joe, Bernard, um, let's see, GPS Robo Knight, uh, the Elegrees, um, Elton and Don, and uh, let's see who else, Gordon, if there's a cure for HIV in Florida, they say they're testing on monkeys, they, they may it work or not, but let's just say it worked, and it worked in humans. Um, the reasons why it's probably not making it out over here is because your Negro there, your bald Negro, decided for his revenge to come do his terrorist attack or the Elton and Don, their terrorist attack back and forth. So when you have large groups going back and forth seeking revenge for people's made up stories, it's going to be harder to distribute that cure. And if you guys don't care, you're going to keep humping and reinfect yourselves. Then what's the point of mass distributing that cure? if common sense doesn't kick in first. Everybody wants to cure. So let's just assume that they're all cured. And then you guys just basically send people over from the East Coast to just make people's lives a living hell. So that's my why my, it's kind of working out here. It isn't. They might be trying it. They might not be. But obviously you have some people like DJ Dave and Quinn Wands reinfecting people because they think they're better or whatnot because they're the bit it or whatever. So that also helps to prove that Ellery is not my grandfather, and he's probably one of the main causes of why you guys are getting censored and blocked. Um, I don't even know if you are my grandfather anymore, Joe or Robo Knight, because your attitudes don't make sense for people who ha have children. Because that would be the first ones I'd cure. Street gangs, I don't know. You guys know I don't hang out there. So it's you guys' made up story as opposed to going at the news articles and your hack. Um, that might be why we're getting, not getting there to where we need. So like I said, the military and all them, they go, hey, look, we got cues for this stuff, but you, a lot of you are all out of control and or have uh, some allegiance to some terrorist groups first other than your health. So, I don't know. Mm, Florida. Some made-up stories by the Quinn Wong and Jessica, maybe, Jordan, you know, and then you older adults with your myth the indian myth so yeah we could have been brian set in and everything was all clean or we were probably the first ones really early to get it tried out but everybody wigged out and he's all saying well i got all this data on you it's like well if i was killed then how could that be true it seems like there's some people getting a benefit of it and others are not but really people know the stuff's there but they don't want to work together um Technology, this, that, the big old thing. Or it could be, Joe, that, you know, every there was a time that everybody was trying to help you and the DJ Dave in the Quinn Juan in the first place, and you guys got so spoiled and fucking pig-headed. She decided to sit there and clone up like a fool, trying to cure herself from a disease instead of actually going to the professionals for help. Or you guys are trying to make people so got purpose to cure them so you look like heroes, which looks dumb because you don't have the right research or material to make that happen because you didn't go to those institutes who developed the cure. So doing it yourself, Lita, yeah, you might get it, but I don't know if I necessarily, you, you, I don't know if they're going to put you in any science books for that. Joe, Harry, come on, especially if there's a better way to distribute it. And if I was on that other side for that stuff, and you guys have people running all around trying to figure out what what we're supposed to do because parents are telling us kids to do this and that oh, you know or when you ran out certain families their minister because you think you're going to save the world all by yourself and that's not really true you know indians want to cure they don't want to feel shit they need different myths different uh beliefs but in the end you all needed the technology and hospitals and stuff in the first place when you get your boo-boos so the cops and the paramedics laugh because they pay attention to the medical journals, but the doctors a little bit more, and they go, oh shit, we got cures for this stuff, but Joe's gotta have his carny, carny carnival, hillbilly carnival, instead of like wise up, and you know, supposedly Lita and some people were killed, but you know, I think the one who was infecting him was a grown adult. Because he was caught a raping. And then he spread his seed and then blamed a Negro boy like four or five times that didn't do anything wrong. So that could be your problem. And then 
you got people trying parents all wigging out and like well see if you guys told me i had to stay in colorado the entire time in my youth i probably would have stayed but i don't and so you guys get some kicky laugh and see that kind of tells me lita that you might be in florida or on the east coast conducting terrorist attacks with your gangs and your gangs are getting sick out here while the rest of these people have to and they're their house values and everything, property values skyrocket, trying to take care of the mess that a couple kids or a group of kids created. So that's why I say I tell the cops and the military and those guys, hey, relax, take it easy, man. You know, get yourselves, protect yourselves, your families, get those kids going, alert these schools, protect them. And they say, hey, look, we tried helping some of these guys on the street here. But they, they got some allegiance to some gangster stuff that doesn't make any sense as a, and they're miserable but they want to feel better but they got some protest against Hollywood celebrities or the government that's saying hey you got to do more than just sit there on your ass and watch TV. Right? Oh the diversity article in Africa. Okay. So there might have been other species but it also says African Americans damn near you're so warlike you kill everything. So yeah, dude, I don't, he, Mr. Stanky, she saw her coming and she left. She, she's like, well, we've had this problem before. And then she, they take off. It's like, are you guys going to let it, this dude do this stuff for you? Oh, well, what do you, what? You, I don't know if Jesus is going to, with this kind of information, is going to clean it up for you all every time. It's like, so if I was him and I was all cleaned up, I'd be like, they can do it themselves. And I was well on my way doing that until Mr. the minister team comes in with this four-year onslaught of torture, and then he gets pissed at the military and then go and make fun of them in the news. Because it gets old having to do this when people know something used to work out here. So some spoiled brats who might be the Fausts who are loyal to the grandfather that they slept with, which is sick. Which leads to me to believe, Joe, you're the one that slept with kids and made them sick. Or you, Harry? Oh, we could just do whatever we want. We got the cure. Right? Or the Ellery's. Or you, GPS, Robo Knight, hidden. Right? 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 That's why I don't like that shit. And then Harry's like, well, I was the king of the strip clubs. Well, they don't do cures anymore because guess what? The riffraff came into your clubs. And I was a high roller in one of those clubs, so, and I wasn't sleeping with those chicks, so it'd be hard for me to infect them with the disease. So if you got some fucked up story going on in Colorado and passing it around there, Joe and Harry, that's your fucking problem. That's Quinwan's problem, because if she wants to save the world, <laughs> you can't have a bullshit story. And now you have a disease, obviously, that's spreading. And it's showing up in a girl that I've never slept with. Huh. Queen Juan. <laughs> Who do you think I'm going to believe more? You or Jamie Conway. And she's a bit older than you. And so I think I trust her knowledge a little bit more than a little Queen Juan who's supposedly 30 and been cloned in and bitted in many times. Which is, can be considered illegal immortality because you don't let anybody else catch up. So, you guys got to get over a religious stigma. Religion is still going to be there. But it's just science too. And they're trying to get you guys to realize something. That the gangster movement don't work. And you probably don't want LGBT. Because some of those people think they have something special to the world. When really, guess what? When you mate with the wrong stuff and you don't have something clicking quite right up in there. Well, you get mutations and defects. Like that diversity thing. That's why I don't have anal sex. Get it? Because it's nasty. I don't want that shit up in my body. It's bad enough that I gotta put it out. So, bitted, people cleaned up, so people got, so Joe, yeah, okay, you will be the vampire, but it doesn't mean I'm gonna respect you because you fucked your family over and then probably we were all set and all cleaned up and we we're supposed to do our job and you had to have a, have a sex fucking scandal instead. Because some people had a different idea and paid the money to do it. And then your little factious gang from the hillbilly rodeo up there came down and ruined it. 